What's good, what's good, and welcome back to Investing with Jack. So we're going to go over Hollow Chain. hot, hot, hot. Um, we're down 7% on the day. It is trending downwards, but we'll get into it. Nothing to worry about. Um, might be entering, entering into a buy zone. So we're down 50% on the week. We're sitting at a $2.23 billion market cap, and the 24-hour volume is $3.10 million. Now, there hasn't been uh, too many recent announcements on their Twitter, so we're going to go straight into the technical analysis for HOT. So we're here on the 4-hour chart, and you can see, guys, as as we've talked about in other videos like wink um, we're having resistance on the emas on the 20 the 20 ema uh, it's hitting its head and it's pushing the price downwards and we're seeing quite a bit of sell-off we've lost support here at about uh, well we're trying to hold support at 0.013 um, to create a little bit of a double bottom here but you can see the sellers are pushing the price down um, so there is the chance of that bottom that double bottom so we could find support uh, in this area here at 0 0.011 and then our absolute bottom here for for hot was about 0 0.010 if we don't go all the way down to the bottom of this wick the bottom of the wick is about 0 0.008 so um you will see more sell-off here as we are uh the emas are above the candles and um we're seeing quite a significant sell-off here and if we put it onto the one hour uh, it's going to show the same here so yeah we can see we're just completely rolling over we've lost the emas on the one hour we've lost the emas on the four hour so let's quickly pop it over to the daily so we can see here on the daily chart we've lost the 50 ema um so we're most likely going to come down to this bottom here at about 0 0.011 and create a double bottom as you can see here it looks like a w so you have your left side of your w and then you come up and you come down to form a double bottom um so this would be a great uh time to buy in my opinion a, a terrific buy zone if we make it down to 0 0.011 and find support there um that would definitely be a terrific buy zone in my opinion so we'll zoom out which is the most important thing um, because i'm still bullish on hot and it's just healing up here so we see here on hot on the one week chart uh, we're going to come down and allow the 20 ema to catch back up to the candles and use it as support we can see here for hot we had an insane pump in march so if we go to this candle here which is about right around march 1st and we go all the way up on this absolute insane pump to about march 29th you're looking at a 1000 percent gain for hot so for it so the fact that it's going through a correction of basically 72 percent is nothing that you should be worried about we just went through a thousand percent pump um, so it's normal we're seeing this with wink with btt where they had massive pumps and now they're having their 70 to 60 percent correction and basically it looks like this you have your massive pump you have your corrective wave and then the ema the yellow line catches back up and you have your next pump so we will re so we will retrace down to this bottom of 0 0.011 and if we aren't able to hold that as support well we could come down here to uh 0 0.010 great buy zone in this area and if you were to take a position in that area and we go take out our high and then we go up towards our next price target here of uh, about 0 0.044 cents well you're looking at a juicy gain uh for hot of about 351 percent to that next price target for hot on this bull run um so nothing to worry about guys i know with many of these charts it's hard to look at it's hard to watch such significant dips and it's hard to see it having a little bit of life and then rolling over again but always zoom out always look at the weekly always look at the ema on the weekly chart and then it can ease your nerves so we can see here on the weekly chart we're overextended we break away from the ema the 20 ema breaks away from the 50 ema we get over too overextended and we have our correction and we find support on the ema it will happen time and time again 100 percent of the time the chart is always going to come back to the emas and it's not the end of the bull run until you see a correction that falls through the 20 ema you see the 20 ema start to start to round downwards and break the 50 and that's the sign of the bull run being over you have your bullish cross on the weekly this is the beginning of the bull run in february for hot and then once 
this starts to roll over and cross over the 50 that's the end of the bull run but when it comes down to find support on the 20 ema all that's showing you is that the chart is healing is that the chart has pumped far too hard and now it's correcting and getting ready for its next impulsive wave up to its next price targets all right guys we still have <laughs> we still have months to go on this bull run we still have tons of juicy gains um so just be patient with the coins that are going through steep corrections it's it's just because they've gone through massive pumps all right guys so uh, if you guys enjoyed the video make sure to smash that like button subscribe you can follow me on instagram twitter uh, you can check out the discord let me know your thoughts on hollow chain are you bullish are you bearish i would love to hear your guys opinions all right and i will see you in the next video much love take care mm -hmm.